for Movie Maniac Monday today. We are going to, to spend the whole day together. So today it's Monday morning as you can see. It's around about 10 o'clock. We already woke up at 3 o'clock, did some yoga, drank our apple cider vinegar and we also had some breakfast. So for now what we're gonna do is we visit, I'm busy doing laundry. So we'll be doing laundry cleaning and eventually we'll be making some popcorn, sit down and watch a movie. I'm not sure which movie we'll be reviewing today, but we'll see. So for today, we'll be spending a day cleaning, laundry and movies. Hopefully you'll enjoy the day with me. For now, let's just start with the laundry.
Hi family and welcome to our Monday Mood Maniac and as you all know today it's Monday and on Mondays we are doing movie review. Hello, hello and welcome. So thank you, thank you for joining me again on this Movie Maniac Monday and welcome to all our, to all our new subscribers and thank you, thank you very much for the love. I really, really appreciate it and welcome to the family. So for today, without wasting any time, as you can see, that we've been doing laundry, we've been cleaning, we've been doing everything today. So after doing our chores for the day, we decided to watch a movie. And the movie which we watch today is called Peak. So this movie is actually like a simple movie. It was a very, it's a very beautiful movie though, I must say. So, without wasting any time, this movie is all about if you love uh, food, if you love animals, um, if you love Nicolas Cage, then that's the movie for you. So, the movie, it's, it's, um, it's about a guy which lives in the forest or in the woods with the, his uh, pet, a uh, pig pet. So, what this pig does, is it's kind of like a pig, a pig which can find truffles. Truffles are like a mushroom, they are growing certain underground and so on. So, one of those exotic delicacy kind of food whereby you can easily pay a hundred dollars for a simple meal just because it's got trifle oil or it's got trifle in it. So that's how the friendship I thought that's how the friendship was whereby it was based on the on the pig being the fund of this finding this or foraging these travels and then what they normally do is they would sell the travel to somebody which owns a restaurant in the city so this day what happened is somebody came and kidnapped the pig from the woods and after that the, the, the pig's owner which was and he was we go he was known as Rob in the movie his name is Rob Field. So he uh, his pig head gets kidnapped and then the movie goes around him trying to find his pig fighting uh, going back to his past. So he, after they kidnapped his pig, he tried he went back tracing who took his pig and so on. So the pig, uh, the, the, the pig kidnapping took him back to his past life. So in his past life, before he lived in the woods or with the pig alone, he was a well known chef. So he used to cook with these beautiful meals, he used to have these beautiful memories with people. I'm not really sure what happened, why did he cut himself out of the whole world, so why did he decide to go stay in the woods and just be only passionate and about an animal. So he goes back to his past and then in his past people which knows him were surprised that he's still around and everybody, most of the people are still talking about him, he is like a, a legend of some sort. So the movie actually, it's about food, as I said. So he he made uh, the, the 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 person which he normally used to come the try come and fetch the trifle from the from the from the woods, uh, which I said is the one which he used to sell the trifle at his restaurant. For his father also owned the restaurant, so it's kind of like those. Um, does relationship whereby the father doesn't really acknowledge the son and so on so the, they don't really have a good relationship so Rob which is Nicholas Cage is like the glue which puts everything together with food as much as he's looking for his cat 
<laughs> he's looking for his peak. He also got that kind of uh, love and passionate for trying to fix this family or trying to make this family proper. But then it's all done by food and then how food can trigger memories and so on. So he he went to meet his old friends, fight with some of the friends, trying to be, find out where is his peak. But eventually, he turned out that the peak died anyway in the old age. After everything's been said and done, with the, the, the kidnappers came to kidnap the the the, the, the peak. They didn't handle the peak properly, so it was hurt badly. So the peak did die. And yeah, um, the person which you kidnapped, you would send people to kidnap the pig, were the father of the child, which the, the guy which used to go and fetch the trifles from from the woods. And then uh, Rob, which is the, Nicholas Cage, was the one which was telling the guy, the child, the person that this it was actually not about it. the trees grow and so on and then the, the one was surprised that okay why do we have to come all the way here into the city and we go through all of these if we you know how to find travels without the pig and then he was like because he loves the pig and he really did break down and he could feel the emotions and the hurt when they told him that the pig died yeah so he was kind of on those lines whereby a person loves animals and will do anything to protect and save its animals. I think it was kind of like a different movie from the previous movies because normally it's not an animal, it's a most a human being whereby the other human being loses it and will fight to try to get that person back. So this one was kind of like a different thing. So it was a good movie, I would suggest it to anybody which, as I said before, which loves Nicolas Cage and which uh, loves animals and food and because it's got like very beautiful uh, pictures, it's got very beautiful, I like the way how it, the movie was shot because you can, you can see the picture, you can feel the emotion in the picture. So. Uh, I don't have much to say and all I can say is I'm a fan of Nicholas Cage so this was a, a nice movie for me to watch after having seen him in action in a long time so I enjoyed the movie and yes I also love food so it was also a nice movie to watch whereby it's not a typical fighting movie but this one is kind of like the story trying to understand emotions and that's all I got from the movie so hopefully you family will check out the movie and enjoy it if you do so for today I won't be long I just wanted to say thank you very much I really appreciate all the love and support and thank you thank you very much for all the new family members I really really appreciate